So the theory is if you ask a guy that you're dating to peel your orange, and if he does it, then he's a good man. I want to be a hobo. Show him, the, show him my pee gaze. Yeah. That's and, me. And, and boxer briefs. <laughs> yeah. Oh shit! So she wants to talk over them. Sometimes when I piss at me out so bad and he raise his voice, I go, oh! I'd be like, wash your tone. <laughs> and you raise your tone at the same time. I can better debate You're their lame. topic. That's wholesome. Lame. That's wholesome. That's not lame. Bro. Lame. You're too. You're, you're too much of an adult. <laughs> <laughs> Once I went to Disneyland for like a school trip in eighth grade, and this guy had like a lunchbox that the school gave him, and I just passed out. And I was like, I'm just so hungry. And he's like, he bent down. He was like, here, take my sandwich. So okay. if she killed someone, you just be like, let's go. Yeah, hide the body. Hi guys, it's Floski. Welcome back to episode seven of Flow and Tell. And we are here today with Ty and Novi. Today we're gonna to be talking about relationships and I have a few questions to ask them. Number one is, let's go with like the easy questions, all right? Okay. Okay, thanks. So, okay. Does body count determine your value? No. No. Oh, okay. What about if it's like, oh, the, the last guy I dated, his body count was 83. God I damn, feel like son. I, I know people in the hundreds. Hundreds? Yeah. And are they in relationships or no? Yeah. Happily. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait, so like how long? Like long term? Yeah, not long term, yeah. How old are they? Like closer to my age. Like our age. No way. Yeah. In the hundreds? Because sometimes when like, I think that's fine. Yeah. I think when people are young, yeah, so they, people they go just through that phase. So you're up. fucking at like what, twenty one or something, maybe Ty? whatever. Oh, Ty, Ty, what's your body count? count? Ty, what's, what's your, your body age? count, Ty? I don't know. <laughs> Wait, I'll, I don't know. I'll give you hundred bucks if you tell me your body me, count. Yeah, Ty. I don't know. I don't. I'll buy you Bobo if you tell me. If we can guess count. the range, do, will you say yes? Yeah. Dude, I honestly don't know. Okay, if I had more or that's less a, than fifty. That's a red flag if you don't. That's know. That's not a red flag. Well, it's not. Don't... Yes, because that means you know. I know mine, but it's definitely not a lot. I mean, mine's not a lot. Yeah. Mine's is like it okay? Less. less than ten. I'm not gonna answer any questions in, in this in this segment. I'm not gonna answer any questions in this segment. <laughs> Dude, okay, surprise. Okay, you might not know this, but Ty's actually zero. He's so wholesome and he's so innocent. He's, such a he's wholesome saving guy. it for marriage. He's definitely <laughs> saving his virginity for marriage, guys. It's so sweet. Ty, such he's self such control. A, he's such a white knight. <laughs> well, I'm not a white knight, bro. <laughs> I just got that, a, that virgin energy. Yeah, but he's a happily married simp. He loves to be a simp. <laughs> Why are you guys slandering me so hard right now? We just started. Wait, okay, question. Are you like a gentleman when you're dating? I mean, I like to think so. Like, do you open doors and stuff like that? No. That's not much of a gentleman. Uh, I guess I'm not yeah, a I guess gentleman. What's your example of you yeah, being a gentleman? Yeah. Uh, just being considerate? Okay, how so? Like, example. That's you being a decent human being. I mean, not all human beings are considered. <laughs> Let's get that. That's a but... decent human being. Okay, human well, being. you should follow that. <laughs> what's, what's, like, an example, Ty? Yeah. An example of being considerate? Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, it's just, like, if you get water, you get them water, too. Or, like, okay. you oh, know. convenience. Yeah. <laughs> convenience, okay, yeah, you know, you or have a point. Or if they need help you with something, point. you help them. I don't know. Ow. Oh, about the cramp. Hold on. He doesn't think it's you have his stomach ache. Hold on. No, it's Hold literally on. like my ex would literally do everything for me if he was doing it too. So he's like, if I'm already doing it, then I don't mind doing it for you. I'm just doing double. Yeah, but he could not. He could just not do it and just think about himself. True. True. But the fact that he thought about you to do it is a lot. Okay. But maybe he's scared that she would lecture him if he didn't get. Oh her well, that's water a different too. reason. See? Then. Okay. Do you but do would surprises? You, Oh, I mean, you'd be like, why didn't you get for me? You know the orange peel theory? Wait, no. actually, recently I was talking to Sammy about that because I was watching the videos and I was like making fun of it. I was like, oh, yeah, like I wonder if they do it. And so last night in the living room, Sammy was holding the two oranges and he was like, hey, have you heard of the orange peel theory? And I was like, yeah, I, I was like, why? It. And he was just like, isn't it funny that I've been doing it for you without you without even knowing what the theory was? And I was like, OK, well, that's the theory. <laughs> so the theory is if if you ask a guy that you're dating to peel your orange and if he does it, then he's a good man. Um, basically, like they would do little things. for Yeah, you. That yeah means they would do that's a lot. good. Yeah. There are people that say no. 
Really? really? Yeah. Okay, but I can't imagine saying no. I don't saying know if I can no. believe social media because I feel like sometimes it's acting. Yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. 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 Or sometimes like, imagine if the guy just doesn't know how to peel an orange. He'll just say no. Who doesn't know how to peel a fucking orange? You just never know these days, you know? Or if it's like inconvenient because they don't know how to like open the skin. Some guys will be like, I can see some of the guys I date. I'd be like, can you open, can you peel this orange? They'd be like, why can't you do it? Yeah. yeah, I've cut yeah. mangoes for my significant other. Okay, mangoes are hard to cut. <laughs> yeah, they're yeah. hard. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like I don't cut it just like the nor- like I think some people cut it just like slice it and then How they eat it? in the peel. Yeah, I peel the whole. That's thing really out. nice. Of- That's actually really That's nice. nice. Peel That's the whole super thing. nice of you. Yeah. That's wholesome. See. Okay. Do you do like romantic things? I don't think I'm that romantic. <laughs> okay. Oh, you're not. I don't think so. I mean, younger I was actually. But as I got older, I was just like. So you just don't plan dates and like. Not really. Okay. Do, do you, you like that? Do you should. count, like, oh, this is our month anniversary. I do. I do yeah. years. Yeah, okay. I choose it as like you do month anniversary as the one day that you go date night because you know how people do weekend oh, date nights. Yeah, yeah. I do like one mm. month date nights. Okay. So you just oh, like right. actually dress up, not too much, but you go to a nicer restaurant that you've never been to. Whereas, like, on the oh, weekends, okay. you just go do regular stuff. Yeah, I yeah, should I'm probably not, do that. I'm not romantic. I think it's good because it's, like, really not... <laughs> I can see not romantic. <laughs> yeah, no. Wait, nobody's so you like, don't care, don't dress like, up. Ah. <laughs> I want to be a hobo. Show, the, show my PJs. Yeah, That's and, me. And, and boxer briefs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. You bought flowers? Oh, those things die. Give me the money. See, I... I agree with her. They do yeah. die. But, but yeah. girls do love flowers. Yeah, girls do. Oh, and that's why you get the infinity one, or the ones that last a whole year. But that's just clutter. It still dies. No, it's like you open it and you're like, that's a thought. Yeah, but it counts. still takes up space. Oh my God. <laughs> you know? You no, know, but you're it's a real, not, you're a real not, one, Novi. Not, not, I would say it's not I'm practical. On no I think, I think, I, I, why I think, are you punching I me? I it's not practical to have I it there. I didn't think violence you know? is a part of this. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Okay, whatever. I just think it's the thought. No, no, right? it is sweet. You're yeah. right. It is sweet. Yeah. If you and love, every now and yeah. then, I feel like, yeah, why not? If but you love clutter, you love clutter. I, I am a non-cluttering person, okay, Novi? <laughs> with that plant just standing yeah, you there. You see that flowers we'll over there? Right oh, there? yeah, look you at those the flowers. flowers over there. These are decorations, okay? <laughs> I'm a non-cluttering person. <laughs> okay. Um, all right, let's see. Next question was... Uh, Wait, where am I? Oh, yeah. What are some red flags in a man? Okay. <laughs> oh, my God. I have to think about well, this. I'm just going to sit woman. here. <laughs> okay, you have to okay what about red flags in a partner? Okay. Fine. Okay, what are some red flags oh, in a partner? No. What are your red flags? Wait, I need to think Leaving about heart this. messages. <laughs> what messages? Like heart emojis in a message. On like someone else's. Yeah, that's not your partner. That's not your partner. Yeah. Okay, I was like, you don't want them sending you heart emojis. Oh no, oh, wait, like, like there's leaving heart messages, heart emojis to the friend. What if it's a the what if it's sex. not what a red like, heart? What happens if it's like what happens if it's like a happy birthday heart? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what, fine. what if it's a black heart? Oh like, shit! That's that's fine. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about a red. <laughs> A oh, red heart, okay? You can't be saying like, oh, I just ate some ramen, ha ha, heart. Or well, that like, doesn't even make sense. have a good night, heart. Okay, okay, I think, that I think makes it sense. depends like, on the context. Yeah, right? it was nice okay. hanging out with you. Heart, winky face, heart okay. eyes. What the fuck? <laughs> with the heart bubbles. Yeah. Heart bubbles. <laughs> oh, that's a lot, to be honest. That's a lot. I would say it con- depends on the context. Yes. I can say I've never done that. When I'm with someone, I've never sent like hearts, person. like neither. Happy birthday, heart. No, I send I, I instead of heart, I send the like the streamers. Oh yeah, okay, okay yeah, I do that too. Yeah, but I don't send the heart. I well, the only reason why it bothers me is only just because I'm scared that the other person of the opposite sex would take it the wrong way, and then they'll try to like put advances on them. Yeah, but don't you trust your partner oh, to yeah. to deflect I those have advances? Trust issues, okay, tight. Okay. okay. <laughs> Uh, she admitted that's, it. She admitted yeah, it. you know, that's you. I also trust that yeah, she's that's okay. You. I'm working on it. Okay? I know yeah. my chat's out here judging me. <laughs> yeah, keep judging yeah, her. I think... Humble her, please. Yeah, I think it's, no. I think, yeah, it's they you. Judge it. It's her. I see you judging. <laughs> All right? Um, what other red flags are, are there? What about, like... Is it a red flag if you're friends with opposite sex? No. Nah. I'm comfortable with yeah, that. What if, too. what if, like, you're cuddling platonically? And you're single? No, you're in a relationship. Why and you and your partner else? is cuddling with someone else? No, Just, no, no. If, if, for instance, like we were in a relationship and then you were cuddling with Flo. 
Yeah, that's weird. That's weird. Who does, who does that? <laughs> there are some people I know that have done that. That's why. Oh, hey, yeah. I, but I, they call it platonic, I, so that's why they think it's okay. I mean, I'm not gonna judge anyone that does cuddling that. Cuddling or like sitting next to each other closely, because that's different. Like, well, I used like to do piggyback down. rides with on. Oh, that's fine. On my me. guy friends, I thought oh, that's, was, fine. that's fine. Oh, okay. Some guys didn't like fine. that. Oh, I thought you meant like cuddling, like in bed, like. Well, no, no, that's what like, she means. Yeah, cuddling, that's like, like that's, that's, me, that's weird. Like you're just leaning on them or something. That's like not that. my thing. Oh. But I think if people are all on the same page, like all those people, whoever's yeah, involved, yeah. are all on the same page. Sure. Yeah, me too. Okay. But yeah. not for me. Like, if they, <laughs> if, me I feel either. like if they don't I'm care, gonna, then cool. Yeah, yeah. But if they actually care, then that's mm. different. I'm not going to cuddle with someone. Yeah, if I'm I ain't with cuddling someone. with Ty. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> well, I wouldn't cuddle with you either. <laughs> but, but I'll stick mostly with yeah, Ty. Yeah, go away, bro. I'll stick with you. <laughs> is, it, is it bad that your friend is a red flag if you're friends with your ex? Nah, I, I feel like it fine. depends if like how you guys broke up. Yeah, if it was like you break up because you guys just fell out of love mm-hmm. and you guys remained friends, that's fine. Yeah, that's that's fine. fine. Yeah, yeah. And as long as I think after you guys didn't talk about like the relationship of what ifs mm-hmm. and stuff like, like that, you, like you're not always reminiscing of your time. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, you know the like, days. Yeah. Yeah. Remember that one time, time like, when imagine, you walked by the beach holding hands in front of your significant <laughs> other. <laughs> So fun. Yeah, no, that that's weird. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like the fuck. Yeah. That's uh, yeah. That'd be that wild. would make me so uncomfortable yeah. if someone did that to me. Yeah, my red flag is actually the opposite. Then it's like more of like if they're jealous or too jealous of me or like of me interacting with other girls. Oh, you don't okay. like that. I don't like that. What? It, okay. Uh, okay, a little bit of jealousy though does show like you care a lot. Nah, it's no, it's insecurity. That's what they but, say. No, it's but insecurity. There are so many different avenues yeah. to show that you care than to make someone jealous. Yeah. No, okay, yes. listen, I'm gonna defend. Okay, I'm gonna jealousy. Defend, okay, all right, oh, talk, go ahead. I'm like cook. You go, go. I would, okay, I'm like a cook. All right, <laughs> so there's jealousy to where like you're not controlling them. But um, okay, let me think. So it's like okay, uh, let's see here. <laughs> so so okay 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 okay. I have different spectrums of my jealousy back then. Okay, I learned a lot. Damn, hey, a spectrum. Eye rolls. Okay, eye rolls okay, no go. eye rolls. All right. Okay, okay, go. Um, first one was I used to be very jealous when my ex would literally be working out next to a girl. Okay, that was like back then. He okay. wasn't even talking to her. He wasn't looking at her. He was just existing next to her and working out with her. <laughs> and I was like mad. But I took responsibility for it because I knew that that was just straight jealousy. And then there's other ones where it's like there's jealousy to where it seems like your boyfriend is kind of giving another girl more attention than he gives to you. But you know that's not true unless he actually is. And if that's true, then that's a problem. Yeah. yeah. So there's like that, you know. That type of jealousy. Or, or but are you in your head about it? Maybe. But like he just talked to her for five seconds. You're like, damn, why is he no, talking to her for five no, hours? No, it would be more. It'd be like, like, oh my God, you're so cute. Ha ha ha. You ha, can't ha, call ha, another girl. Yeah, why would he compliment? Okay. Why would he be complimenting her? Because she said something. She just looks cute. Okay. What if he's like, oh, you look cute. Or, or what if like. Um, I don't know. He just spends more time talking to her. And he kind of just like forgets about you for the rest of like a party or something like that. And just spends more time with this other girl. It just like would make me slightly jealous, but I'm not like going to be crazy about it. I'm just gonna be like, Oh, Hey, like kind of wish like you hung out with me more that mm-hmm, day. But mm-hmm. is that like an occasion? You know, like sometimes you're just with your partner all the time and you, you go to an occasion where you finally see a friend. So you're trying to catch up. Yeah. Is it like one of those? No, it's like he just met her. And he's just getting to know her. And yeah, you're wondering and it's why. just him and her the whole time throughout the party, just like having fun, laughing, and talking. And what are like, they talking about? <laughs> I don't know. And he doesn't try to bring you in. No, or no. I think that is a red flag. I don't think that's. I think that's weird. Yeah, I think that's unless just you're, weird. Unless if you're just standing there doing nothing, that's weird. Yeah. Okay. That happened yeah. to you? Yeah. No, oh, you sure. want to know what my red flags were? Was like what? when a guy tells me, like, hey, my ex used to. Oh, God. Uh, oh, no. My oh, ex God. used to put my dishes away. Why don't you do that? Like after we eat, that's manipulative, right? Yeah. <laughs> did it work on you? Uh, it I, did. No, no, we heard. <laughs> no, we heard. I was worked. like, oh. At first, I didn't know that it was bad to say that, so I was like, oh, okay. Like, I guess I'll go put your dishes away. My bad. Now, are like, you a maid? I, th- I thought that that was like okay to say until my oh. therapist said you can't 
Like, yeah, that's not right. You don't need a therapist to be told that. I could have told you that. <laughs> <laughs> well, because I was like, oh, like, she went you... through a lot. Okay, yeah, yeah. I know. I know. <laughs> she went through a lot. <laughs> what about like red flags you notice in your relationships besides jealousy? Um, it's and mostly about in my past. It was just mostly like jealousy. There are times where like there's just not tr- enough trust there or something. Well, I think it's a red flag if they're like on their phone and you just need to just look and they go like, oh, I hate that. I'm flinch. like, what the fuck? Like, what are you trying to hide? Right? Would you look at that? Yeah. You know? Some what people are, like, are just like, private people. Okay, wait, this is your okay? boyfriend. Would you share yeah. your phone you know? with your partner? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. And like too. you'll let her look through everything? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. I wouldn't want to, but I would. Oh, but because it's just, just on the principle, like you should trust me that I'm that I don't have anything. But if you really want to see it, sure. But you're disappointed. Yeah, yeah but I'm disappointed. Okay, Why? Yes. Because you should trust me. Oh, for me, it's just like I don't know if you want to look at my phone. I might be talking shit about you when I was mad. <laughs> 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 That's a whole saying, different thing. I know. Bro. I was warning you. <laughs> <laughs> I'll talk shit like that. That's crazy. You know, sometimes you're like angry. And you want to tell your friends about it. I That's guess I'm true. Not angry you know. Enough. <laughs> oh, what about you, Dovi? Do you have anything? No, that was that was mine. Like my the phone thing. Oh, checking. Yeah, if like no, I'm no, just no. like leaning over. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. If she's yeah. trying like, to check, oh, if yeah. she's trying to peep. I'm not even trying. I'm just like sitting there, sitting or down. Sometimes like, like my ex. Or you try to reach yeah, for the phone. Even, yeah. Just, or no, you're reaching over his actually, phone. Actually, it only happened to me with my ex. Like Sammy, it doesn't happen. Mm. I think it's sort of like if you're like going like um, every time they put their phone facing down, like this face screen is always face down. Oh, they're oh. trying to hide something. Okay. Yeah. But sometimes guys would be like, oh, it's just because I don't want to be distracted by my phone. Yeah. Okay. I do that sometimes. That yeah. is a thing. But I do think sometimes they're, it's it's also like a tactic to like, they don't want anything to pop to up. To hide their side yeah. pieces. Okay. Yeah. I think it depends where you guys are. So if you're watching TV together, it makes sense. But if mm-hmm, you're just mm-hmm. like sitting there chilling, I'd be like, just leave it open. Yeah. Mm. Your mom might be calling you. I have you. more trust for guys that leave their phone open. Because then, okay. yeah, it makes me feel like, oh, cool. Like they have nothing to hide. I leave my phone face up because I don't want my screen to get scratched. Same. <laughs> yeah, that's what that's what I think about. Yo, I don't even think about hiding stuff. That, I'm that just like I don't way. want my screen to be scratched. Bro, I, I, I put it face down sometimes because when I'm doing stuff, I don't want to constantly be looking if I see it flashing. Yeah, that's like I get uh, some people they say that. Yeah, but I get annoyed when I walk into the room and they're immediately like closing oh, their phone. Oh, and they uh, flip it. Okay, yeah, that's or like weird. you that's... walk into the room, it's open, and they go. Yup. Yeah, that's a red flag. Yeah, I don't like that at all. Yeah. yeah, it's a red flag for sure. Yeah. Any other red flags? Um, Let me try to think. What other red flags were there that I did not like? Mm, I can't think of one. Particular. People would say like... Mm, I don't like yelling, but that's just a preference, right? Some people are okay with it. They don't like me. <laughs> no, you're fine. You're fine. No. Oh. <laughs> like, no, Am like, I a walking no, no, red no, no, flag? Like, like if we get into like... A discussion or an argument, like okay. you don't need to yell. We can talk at a normal volume, mm-hmm. and we can sometimes can't help it. It's, I would say it's because she's being, you're angry. Being, you're, being, you're being passionate. She's, sometimes you just no, can't it's control not it. You know? It's not passion. Or sometimes, it's not sometimes passion. like someone's talking loud, but you wanna be a little it's louder. Why? 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 What's the need for that? <laughs> Actually, when I got sometimes, she wants to talk sometimes over Sometimes when them. I piss Samuel so bad and he would raise his voice, I go, oh! I'd be like. Wash your tone, <laughs> and you raise your tone at the same time. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, wash no, your you're tone. You're a hypocrite, bro. You know, my therapist, she actually told me that screaming is a way of manipulation. It is really. Yep. Yeah, it's meant to make you shut up. You're trying oh, to, to like drown them out. Fear. Yeah, you're trying uh-huh. to drown okay. out their yeah. words. Shit, shit. I'm walking. Don't next time, next time, Sammy yells at you, like, you're a manipulator. <laughs> <laughs> the, the, if I use that line, then he would use it more often than me. Oh, because yeah, you yell always, more. Sammy's so calm. Yeah, yeah Sammy's me. calm. Sammy's oh, calm. Okay. Yeah, Sammy, it. Sammy's calm. He just complains. That's all. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. It was pretty funny. He would be walking. I'd be like, and he would be complaining. I'd be like, here goes Mister Complainer <laughs> again. You're so toxic. <laughs> Wait, God, like, are you laughing? Are yeah, you yeah, she's oh, laughing. Yeah, I'd be like, that's oh, oh, exactly how she sounds. Yeah, I'd be like, Mister Complainer for the day again. He was told me he would like say something yeah. and you would just like close the door slowly. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, I don't hear you. I'm like, not today. You guys are funny. <laughs> That's so funny. That's actually really funny. 
like that. Okay, it's like that's, a pretty, that's pretty toxic, but yeah, that's what I do. Pretty toxic. Well, yeah. I think it's like a good way to kind of just laugh off and not take it too seriously. Um, are they, are they laughing though? I mean, I she mean, is. I mean, like, she's laughing. But yeah, is I'm he laughing. laughing. What's he upset about? I think it's just like anything that would like it's an inconvenience, you know. Which I get mm. you're complaining, but sometimes I'm like it's taking my energy. That I just cl- I close the door. I say something back. Maybe he just likes to like. I think sometimes he likes to complain just to vent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah like he doesn't and, really care if you're listening. I mean, a lot yeah, of people yeah. do that. What What are your other red flags, Novi? Me? <laughs> yeah, that you like, have in uh-huh. particular. Yeah. I'll tell you my red flags. Of me or of you? Of myself. Okay, you go first. No, you. I asked okay, okay. You. I would say. I'm like super impatient, to a mm. point where it's just like I'm not gonna wait an extra minute. But people should be willing to wait an extra minute for me. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like my time so is important. Straight up hypocrite. You know. <laughs> yeah, time. Straight up hypocrite. Yeah. Okay. At least I'm admitting it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know. I know. Good. So you can work on it, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. Are you, are you working and, on it? And I, I don't know if this is a red flag, but if I get into an argument with someone, especially like my sisters, I rally my team behind me. I'd be like, everyone, you're backing even me up, right? Even if she's wrong. Yeah, even if I'm wrong. I will convince everyone, gaslight everyone to believe that I'm right. Yeah, that, I <laughs> mean, but I want to say 99% of the time, I am right. The fact that you 99% use... 99% of the time, okay? she's right. Yeah, so... The fact that you use the word gaslight is already... You, know, right you, you gotta do what you gotta yeah, that's do. True. That's true. It's like the 1% that I'm wrong. Oh, really? Which is rare. Rare. I guess I would say my, my red flags are jealousy. Mm-hmm. And okay. then, which I am working on though. Okay. So, because it used to be really bad. And then it would be interrupting. Ah, uh, interrupting. When oh. I'm heated and mad, sometimes, like, I just, like, like in the beginning, my communication would be good. But once you, like, trigger me or, or I get impatient, then I start to, like, just lose all communication and I give up. And I just start interrupting because I don't want to hear anything. Back then, when me and my sister used to argue, I would cover my ears and be like, la, 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 la. I can't hear you. La, la, la. Oh, yeah, that's <laughs> good. That's good? <laughs> yeah. I think it's the opposite. Like, if whenever I get into an argument, I want to hear what they're saying so I can better... I can better debate You're their lame. topic. That's wholesome. Lame. That's wholesome. That's not lame. Lame. Bro. You're too. You're, you're too much of an adult. <laughs> <laughs> Surrounded by children. <laughs> children. We're not children. Yeah. Gaslighting. No. Yeah. Damn. Ty is red flag. Gaslighting. Yeah. Nah. And a good liar. Yeah. Wow. Very good We're liar. We're all good liars here, okay? I'm, I'm not. actually not. You're I'm such actually a liar. Flo cannot lie. You're such no, a I'm liar. not really a good liar. Yeah. No, you no. were. I you started to cheat. She started stuttering. You're still no, a liar. I'm not a good liar now. I used to be I'm a good liar. Okay, okay. I think you're the best liar out of all of Probably. us right here. Probably. Really? Yeah. She is I'm the best good liar. liar. You can, like, if someone looks at you in the eye and they're like, you swear you didn't do it. But I didn't do did. it. You can look at See? them. Yes. Without like quivering. <laughs> yeah. I didn't do it. Oh shit. That's She's scary. She's the best liar. <laughs> that's scary, no V. Yeah, that's actually scary, bro. It's practice. <laughs> Wait, how are you, what? How are you practicing? It's because you know. She's practicing by practice. lying to people. Yeah. <laughs> that's how you practice. But you just don't lie for fun though, right? You just Yeah, lie. no, I don't lie for fun. Uh, yeah. I don't know. But it's like more of like if you get, <laughs> if you're gonna get in trouble, you know? I don't know. You, you know, just like, don't like, like any did you, trouble? did you steal my stuff? Like, I probably did take my sister's clothes, but no, it wasn't me. See? You, know? you just don't want to get in trouble. You see this? Yeah, you don't want to get in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> you, yeah. you, you lie for self-preservation. Yeah. She right, just doesn't right. want to feel like... Maybe it's like, right. I wouldn't lie about, like, other things that are, like, stupid, you know? Is it because you don't want to apologize? Can you what? apologize? Yeah. Do you? Have you? Yeah. Oh. I do apologize. Okay. When I know I'm wrong. That 1%. <laughs> So she doesn't apologize. <laughs> she doesn't apologize. Like, have your sisters watch this? Like, does Novi apologize? No, you know who doesn't apologize? My little sister. She's like the worst. I think she the would, youngest. She would, yeah, she would accuse me of stealing her like headphones. And then she opens her backpack and is there. And she'd be like, <laughs> and doesn't apologize. And yeah. I'm just like, what the fuck? It's the same with my younger brother. Yeah. He has a he has like a huge problem with apologizing sometimes. Yes, yeah, sorry, he just can't is not say there. But yeah. well, just so you know, I am the younger sibling. Yeah, and I have no problem with apologizing. What about back yeah. in the day? I had to, because oh, if I didn't yeah, apologize, true. it would get worse. Literally, our fights would combust. So I decided to just say, okay, 
I'm sorry. He just took the L every Even time. Even though I had no idea what I was apologizing for, I was apologizing for. She'd be like, "What are you sorry for?" And I had to think back, like, "What was she complaining about?" <laughs> I'm sorry for this. I'm sorry for that. I'm sorry for that. And she's like, "You're literally just copying me." And I'm like, "I gotta think of a new way to say it." <laughs> oh shit! Master liar. <laughs> so I had to like flip it and be like, "I'm sorry that this happened." Sometimes I had a fake cry just to show. That I was like really apologetic. Damn, see, I don't even cry. You, so she would drop it. You don't cry. I don't cry. She's crying. She's using tears to make people feel bad. Yeah. Look, because, because I ain't trying to fight, all right? Oh. I wanted it to go away. I hate <laughs> conflict. Oh, <yeah. laughs> so if you don't believe my initial sorry, I'll cry then. So that it makes it seem more believable. I can't fake cry anymore. I used to could really oh, fake okay. cry well, though. I, I think you can. I feel like no, you could. No, I, I have not. I no. feel like you could. If you really I wanted think, to. I think sad thoughts, sad I feel thoughts. Like you could. If I just stare a little too long, I can kind of tear up and cry. You should be like, hold up, you yawn. <gasps> no, <but> right? <laughs> I'm so sorry. Well, that's yeah. crazy. You know, I used to uh, fake fainting. Shut up. Really? No ba- way. Back in the day, yeah. I used to fake fainting from middle school all the way until for what? high school, yeah, end of what? high school. Just to get out of stuff? To get out of stuff. One, to get out of school. Two, to get a guy's attention. What the To fuck? get a that, guy's that attention. That works? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Once I went to Disneyland for like a school trip in eighth grade and this guy had like a lunchbox that the school gave him. And I just passed out. And I was like, I'm just so hungry. And he's like, he bent down. He was like, here, take my sandwich. And I was like, oh. what the? <laughs> you can't trust these yeah. girls. Oh, my God. Oh, I feel like if someone did that, I'd be like, fuck? oh, you fainted? Oh, that sucks. And then I didn't yeah. want to walk. I would be the guy to give this. Yeah, you would. <laughs> you would. If I had a crush on you, I would totally have done I'll, that. I would be like, oh, here's my sandwich. Yeah, it's like, yeah. I'm cold. Give me and your I shirt. It was sweet. <laughs> and I wanted to like, sometimes when we were at Disneyland, I remember I didn't want to walk anymore because i was oh so exhausted God. so i passed out like so that apex. my teacher could carry me <laughs> <laughs> and then i didn't want to go to church and so i passed out in church so i could just go take a nap <laughs> or or like um this guy like my crush i would like play football and he accidentally hit the football on my head and i passed out <laughs> so he can come and save me <laughs> She's so extra. Hers is, yeah, hers is She's extreme. So extra. Extreme acting over there. <laughs> yeah. Extra manipulative. Yeah. That was pretty manipulative, right? That's hella manipulative. Hey, I'm a good actress, though. If I'm able to. Yeah. Uh, good fake actress, fame. good liar. <laughs> I could imagine the slow motion. <laughs> Sometimes, like, my, me and my exes would get in really bad arguments. I was just fake passing out just so they would shut up and feel bad. Like, that was me back then. I would be like, I can't focus anymore. <laughs> I just leave the room. I'm kinda, yeah, me too. I'm kind of embarrassed that yeah, they believed it. I'm so embarrassed for them. Okay, uh, just so you guys know, I'm not like that anymore, though. Okay, I gave up on that mm. life. Okay, okay. I've, I've actually changed so much from that because I used to just faint every time I could get, like, just want something. That's weird. We just hey, saw you. Ty is <laughs> judging. I'm not. I'm he's just judging, thinking. Bro. I'm just thinking, did he, you now change? He's like, now he's like thinking, he's like, wait, she just fainted yeah, like she... oh, 30 minutes ago over there. <laughs> no, I didn't. I did not faint 30 minutes ago. Okay. <laughs> You heard it from Novi. I did not. Okay. Um, movie died. Um, how can you tell? Oh, wait. Actually, I want to talk about things to never do on a first date. Things to never do on a first date. Okay. W- one, I think for me, uh, what I don't like, like on a first date where they don't get a second date is if they order for me. That happens that to happens? you? That happens? Yes. They order for you. Yeah. They're like, oh, she'll have a salad. No, she'll. So they'll like be like, hey, just pick this and this from the appetizer. Or they'll be like, oh, I got it. I got it. Don't worry about it. And I'm like, oh, but what about the entrees? They're like, no, we're just going to eat from the appetizer section. Fuck. And so I'm like, oh, I want to order this and this. And they're like, mm, are you sure you want that? Oh, so like, they just don't have money. Mm, I don't know if they don't have money. But it's like because then why would you just only order from the appetizer section unless you just couldn't afford the entree? True, I don't know. Yeah, but maybe, that's weird. Yeah, maybe it was happy hour. <laughs> yeah, oh, that happy was hour? it was definitely not happy hour. Oh, okay. Yeah, if it was, I totally would understand because I'd be down for that. Okay. Yeah, uh-huh. but it was not. No, that's weird. Yeah, I mean they can't just order for you, yeah. especially if they they asked you out on a date. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and you try to provide your input, and they said no. Mm-hmm. 
I can't believe that happened. Uh, to yeah, you. I've never experienced that. I don't know. Or a first date when like you're talking to him and they're like, I'm sorry, can you get to the point? Oh, that makes me mad. Oh my freaking god. <laughs> I do that shit to people. No you way. Do? Oh my her god. Face. <laughs> now face. I feel bad. Okay, like oh my god. I do that I do that now too. If you interrupt them and I don't then like, like, like sometimes I do. Cause like Wait, who do you do it to? Sammy. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. Wait, okay, how do you I well, you guys know Sammy. Like he loves yeah. to tell stories. I just want the. He's a good storyteller. Like the thing is, sometimes I'm just like, hey, okay, I'm like, I like appreciate your story, but can you just tell it in three sentences? And I literally count a sentence. I'm like, that's one, that's two, that's three. But it's just like sometimes I'm just like, I hurry up. I want to know the point. It is exhausting. Yeah, especially when some people tell stories, they go into the details. Oh, yeah. Because like, like one time he was telling me a story about a girl in the room. He described the room first. And I was no like, we had to a point where I was just like, okay, wait. So I was like, what's the point of your story? He's like, I actually forgot. And I was like, <laughs> I was like, oh my god. But Sammy is a good storyteller. He is a people great like storyteller. Listening to it, but I don't. Okay, I mean, you've listened to him like, for so like you know so me. Long. I like to like get straight to the point. No, that's me too. I actually, Loki don't like listening to Sammy's stories either. <gasps> oh. <laughs> but I don't say anything. It's okay. just like internally, I'm like, damn, Sammy takes a long time to get to he the point. He just wants to talk. He just wants to talk. And like, like some people, pre- t- I'm pretty sure Ty appreciates it. Yeah. He goes yeah. like I think because he he likes to really put you in there. Yes, yes, yeah. that's what it is. But I don't want to be put. He in wants there. to give you all the details. Yes. Yeah, I don't like details yeah, because me too. I think he himself likes the details. Yeah, like if yeah. To tell him a story. Yeah, he does. Yeah. I yeah I don't. I do have some friends that told me that I do that. Like I get impatient. I'm like, okay, so what's the point of your you story? Do, I think I do remember. Yeah, when I, I like first I cut met people you, off. That, yeah, I cut people off. I'm just like I'm like, what's your what's the point of your thing? Well, sometimes you do something where you're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, and okay. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. I'm just like, come on, I just want to know. You're speeding like, them you know? up. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah speeding and I'm like, I just want you to tell me the straighter point so I could just, I could understand what it Wait, is. Have you ever done that to me? No. 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 I've never heard her say it. Oh, okay. But I feel like you get straight to the point with me. Yeah, I don't. Wait, do I get I straight to the point? Yeah, you do. Oh, sick. Yeah. Yeah. There are people that just like to explain to me why things are a certain way. And I don't want to know the background. I just want to know what it is. Like, tell me the problem yeah. and I'll figure it out. Dude, I had a friend. I literally asked her, I was like, hey, you have any toilet paper left? Oh, shit. And she was like, well, my mom is sleeping. And she <laughs> took did. my dog. And then um, she's going to take a nap because she worked all day. And I was like, I have to pee. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> it's like, it's it? like yes or no. Yeah. Yeah, but like, the thing is like, I have friends I've done that to and they tell me and like, so I'm, I'm like, they know that I'm a certain way. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But it's like, as long as they know if they get you know yeah you get to the point yeah when you tell a story but I, you don't want someone doing that to you I don't like telling do you, do you tell long stories i don't think you tell long stories no so then because it is weird if someone tells you hey get to the point one person has said it to me yeah well because he was asking me like oh what happened with you and your ex and so i was like just trying to tell him he was like can you get to the point and i was like that's i feel like that's such it's kind of. Kind of. Yeah. I didn't know what the point was. I was just trying to. Tell I, was, what I mean, happened. especially if you asked for the story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He definitely asked, asked for, for the, the story. story. Yeah. He asked for it, and then yeah. he was like, "Go faster." There is something like I do to be nice when people are taking too long with stories. My right leg goes out, and I'm like, "Oh, okay, that's cool." <laughs> She's trying to go away. <laughs> She's trying to sneak away. Like, yeah, I'm just like, "Oh shit, where's my phone? I can't find my phone." I'm like, "Be right back," and I go uh, and get my phone just to like stop the conversation mm-hmm. yeah because i don't want to say get to the point it feels mean <laughs> she don't give a fuck <laughs> she don't give a fuck like, like get to the point sometimes yeah, I just, sometimes i just be <laughs> word yeah sometimes i'm just like come on like even in like meetings i'm just like come on you could just tell me in like a sentence I mean, with work though i understand because sometimes, you're no, trying sometimes to people, people, you're trying yeah, to get people through just it repeating and like background so i didn't ask for the background yeah. i asked for I'm the, trying to get my work yeah, are your no. legs shaking or you're just like oh, 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 i'm just like waiting reading i'm like you know yeah yeah sometimes i zone out too yeah mm. but there, i mean like people that know me kind of just like accept it and have told me like called me out for it but i'm just like oh that's just who i am yeah and, like i am impatient yeah, I mean, you know, you know it. So yeah. It's yeah. But I'm just, yeah, maybe I'm just a red worse. flag. No, you're not. You're not yeah. a red flag. Thank you. Don't listen to that. I'm, I'm, I'm a beige flag. Uh, I thought you said a different word. <laughs> I thought you said something else. I thought she said something else, too. I thought she said she was a bitch flag. <laughs> I was like, wow, what the heck? I didn't know that was a flag. No. Wow. Well, I mean, I think something for you. First date. 
what else people do on first dates? Um, I don't know. How, I don't, do you don't you don't go on a lot of dates because she's been in like a really long term relationship. So yeah, you so I'm trying to remember like my past dates. I don't like a kiss on the first date. That, really? Yeah, okay. I don't like that. Like when they lean in, <coughs> it's just like, like it's like. Well, so the guy is trying to get a kiss from you, like yeah, like when they try to put like the moves after like a dinner, mm. I'm like, oh god, like they're probably gonna try and like kiss me, I, like freak out. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I think it's difficult for for guys in that instance though, because some girls, so like you obviously don't don't want it, no. but then there's some girls who do expect it, so like they're always teetering between like Aww. should I should I not? should I lean in or should I not? Yeah. Do you like it when a when a guy Novi is like, can I kiss you? Oh, oh god, I cringe. <laughs> I just cringe right now because that just reminded Wait, me of someone asking ask, me that. Right? I never asked. Oh, thank no. God. Oh, my okay. God. Oh, uh, when I was, I never asked. Guys, when I was in high school, I was at a mall with this guy and he asked me, he looked at me and he says, can I hold your hand? And I was like, I literally was like, no. Yeah. Because I, I would say no. Why would you ask? It yeah. should be natural. I would always say no if they ask me. Then you have high expectations for those Do young you guys. you ask people to hold your hands like if it's natural? No, like, you just be natural. do it naturally. I mean, I think some guys do get the cue and they can do it naturally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I think awkward guys growing up, they just don't. Yeah. In their mind, I think they're just so shy. Yeah. And, and, they're, they're, and they're asking for consent, but I'm just like, ah! They're I just find it attractive when you like yeah. make, take the initiative. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. If you can, yes. Yeah. Yes, it is much and, more And attractive. don't cover your mouth when you eat. Like on a first date when you're like taking a bite out of a burger and you're like, Wait. Wait, you've seen guys do that? Yes. I only see girls do I'm that. I'm not trying no, to remember. I feel like I've it. seen a guy do that. Who I've does only that? seen girls do that. That you know and I know? Yeah. I have no idea. Because I Wait. Would, I, it's, is this going <laughs> to be. Beam. If I say a name? Yeah. Okay, just go cut for it. it out. I'll cut it out. Okay. Wait, doesn't. Doesn't. Cover? Yeah, sometimes. Does he? I don't hang out with him enough. <laughs> sometimes yeah, he, does. he does. Sometimes. There are guys that cover it to be polite. Mm-hmm. Sometimes he does. It's like I've delicate. seen it. I've called him out. I've, I've called him out on it before. Not after every. It's like no, every it's just like now naturally. And then. You know, you're just eating, yeah. and you're just like. You and know? he'll be like, or yeah, just go yeah, like this. Yeah, cover. Um, or I'll do it if I'm about to talk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Like if I want to hurry up and chew, like hold on, like yeah. that. And yeah, I'll yeah, like yeah. People it. just yeah. like cover it. Yeah, mm-hmm. but when they take a bite, that's when it's like weird. Like, okay, but then do like that. It's more natural. You're like talking, and that's fine. Yeah, but when it's like kind of obvious, I'm just like, bro, I'm like. <laughs> I think he does do it because he's trying to talk to it the same Maybe, time. Maybe, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but that's the only person I think of right away. Yeah, that's, yeah. When you said I was, name, like, wait, I was, I like, was thinking, oh, it has to be said. Okay, okay, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is, is it weird, though, if, like, um, it, there's, like, this awkward pause. Have you guys ever experienced when you take a bite and someone asks you a question? You're like, oh. Try to eat really fast to swallow and answer the question. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I've never had that. you never had that? No. Oh, shit. It's like, it's like one of those things where they ask you... Like the server comes to you and just like, oh, how's everything going? I've had that. Oh, like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've had that. I've had that. Like, wait for me to finish this. I like, know. I hate that. Yeah. I'm I just feel like, bad though because they're trying to be a good server. I know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But I'm like, yeah, I'm like, like, that's what I do. I just go like yeah, this. Yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> As I'm chewing. Yeah. <laughs> um, is it okay to sleep around your friend group? No, that's weird. Really? I think that's fine. I think. I it's mean, weird. in theory, it's fine. But it does That's make weird. the environment very awkward. Weird? Like weird if you I mean, are yeah, sleeping yeah. around, someone catches feelings. Yeah, if feelings are caught you know? and things get awkward yeah, and like you yeah. guys don't communicate, it can get weird. Yeah. It can get weird. So is it wrong? No. Could it be weird? Yeah. But what if they break they up and then another one jumps on that one mm-hmm. and everyone's just like dating each and other? And everyone's just like eh, blah, 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 in the circle. Yeah, I mean, I right? guess I guess it depends on, on how often it's happening. Like obviously if one guy's trying to like sleep with all the girls in the oh, group, then it's like, yo, what are you doing? Right? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Right? Yeah. But like like once, twice, I think it's whatever. It's like, there are people who like, every time there's like a new girl that comes in, in mm-hmm. the group, there's like friends who kind of like sharks and they're like, oh yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, 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 like a serial dater, dater yes. of the friend group. Yeah. Where that, that's like their main demographic target. Oh, I thought you guys meant like, so like a, f- or sleeping five around or gr- dating. Five girls, five Both. guys. Uh, Both? Blah, 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 yeah. That's okay. what I thought. You I think had. dating is fine as long as like, you know, you are serious about it and you're yeah. going to go the distance. Whereas yeah. like, yeah, sleeping around is yeah. going to be a little bit more weird. Like but the, it does create a divide in the friendships because if it doesn't work out or there's drama or they're dating each other, it's just like, 
It ruins the friend group. It can yeah. happen. It can like, happen. Have you been in those like situations where the breakup's not good, so it breaks the group? Yeah, it happens. Yeah. But to be fair, I've seen a lot of different things break groups. Yeah, not yeah. Not just relationships. Yeah. That's just one of many mm-hmm. things. Yeah. <laughs> That's why sometimes like I don't like having a big friend group because I feel like there is just more drama. Yeah. Mm, okay. Inherently, yeah. if you have more people, your chances of drama is going to increase. I know. So I'm like, it's like a pros natural and cons. law. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I just personally prefer that if I had friends, they meet their significant others outside of that. Mm. You know, I don't want them to date like with my friends because I don't want to risk it. You, don't you know, if like it. it doesn't work out, that's gonna be awkward. Do I have to choose a side? Like, what's gonna happen? Right. Wait, do you have you know? friends that make you choose a side? There are. They ask. Okay. I I asked her to choose one side. Yeah, for one person. Uh, yeah. I know. I don't ask you to choose a side. I think because unfair. I think it's just because <laughs> like no, it's not. <laughs> it's just like Ty. I think I don't want to put him in that tough situation. Whereas like I think no, that yeah, I think Novi's okay she with it. She can handle it. I'm soft. Like I think Ty can't so- handle it. My heart it. is too soft. If I was literally like, because there is one person that I would be like, please don't. But because I know that you know you are friends with them too and close, that it's very. Mm, I don't want to put you in that situation. I see. But if it's like, say like you had someone really close and like you and I became close, I would do the same for you. Like I wouldn't make you choose side. But if you barely know that person, then I'd be like. And you know me more, then I would make you like kind of be like, hey, can you not? Okay, I can them? say that. Yeah. I, can say I feel that. like it's just hard because like if I were close with both of you guys, I would think that both of you guys are also like unsure of what you could say to me. You know, I kind of like if you tell me something, would I tell the other person and vice versa? So it kind of also mm. makes the trust harder. Hmm. <laughs> right. <laughs> I think you could tell me stuff. You, wouldn't, you it, wouldn't you feel kind of like, oh, I don't know if I could tell Novi because she might tell the other person because she's still close to that person too. No, I, well, not I, using you as an example or anything. I'm saying. Well, I think that like if if I have something to say, I feel like they would already know. Like the other person would already like, know. She fat. Like, like you should be knowing you. The fat. person I asked you to <laughs> yeah. not talk to, you could say whatever if you were close with yeah, them. Yeah. You know, because whatever I'm saying, they probably already know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Or do they? If you're like, blah, 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 it's a bitch. Wouldn't you have some like mutual trust to where like. Sometimes it's hard. (laughs) You know? She has so many friends. Don't tell her anything. But for me, I like, you already know, I'm the type where I would back my friends up. Like if you Mm -hmm. tell me to not talk to someone, I'd be like, all right, bye. Bye. You know? Even if it's like two close friends, I would literally be like, okay, but who do I actually feel a better connection with? And who am I? Like, actually going to be friends with long term. I think Ty struggles with that. Yeah, yeah. Like, Which is, I like, don't. fine. Yeah. yeah, I don't. Yeah, you have to see all the facts before you can even, like, make a decision. Yeah. And if someone asks me to, like, cut someone off, like, with your own reasoning, yeah. it's hard for me just to accept your side of the story mm-hmm. and not hear anything else. Yeah. I mean, even though, like, I might be closer to you, it's just, like, well, in my heart, like, I just feel bad. For also this other person. Because I don't know his story or her story. Yeah, see, I don't care about but that what part. If you, like, you don't care. Yeah. What if you know, like, okay, let's say, for example, you know me the most, yeah. right? Very okay. well. Yeah. And then let's say, like, you know V said, I did this to her. Mm-hmm. Would you believe, she doesn't have proof. Would you mm-hmm. believe me? Like, And you told me you didn't do it. Yeah. I mean, I would probably ask you questions. But it's, I wouldn't believe what you're saying. Interrogation. <laughs> I'd be like, well, you didn't do it? Yeah, you didn't do it. <laughs> nah, I gotta know. My girl didn't because, do it. No, you but because, because, because if they did if they did do something wrong and you supported them, you're encouraging that now. Yeah, I just I, I would be like, so okay. If she killed someone, you just be like, let's go. Yeah, hide the body. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you don't go to prison. Yeah, she's a girl's girl. girl. Okay. Yeah. No, no, no. But Dude, I would, we fly to I would, Asia. We're hiding. I would help her, I would help her hide the body. Okay. But I would be like the whole time, you shouldn't have done this. I mean, yeah, I would too. Yeah, yeah. I would too. Yeah. You I would too. have I would done like, this. I feel like I've told you before, like if you're wrong, I would tell you to your face you're wrong, but I would not let the public know that you're wrong. I'm going to tell the public that you were innocent. I'd be like, yeah, she didn't do it. Like, hey, Flo, you fucked it up. Yeah, like, yeah, 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 she totally you know? would, yeah. Okay, I mean, that, that's me in a way. Like, I'm not going to tell the public, but I'm not going to encourage you if you're doing, like, if you're lying or if you're like, 
you're doing something but bad. you don't know there's no proof so whose side would you take what do you it's mean it's like a he said she said like it's, if just I, a it's, he it's said, hearsay she right said. yeah, 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 it's hearsay. yeah. No, no no i'm saying if i knew but you don't so yeah. if i if i didn't know yeah i would try to believe you oh okay okay Okay. Try. Underline. Try. try to believe Even you. though try. we're super close. It's not, it's not I believe, believe you. you. It's try. It's, yeah, try in my mind, you. it's just hard to believe anything. Right? Well, if you know yeah. the person, if you, know you the can person. fully trust that person. It's like well, you're in a relationship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to put yeah. full trust like, in that person. It's like if you... The relationship's if like, different. Who are you like, not <laughs> close with? It's the same. Like, if it's like if you have like oh, someone that you just met and then there's Flo and then this person was like, Ty, like Flo stole from me. Like, oh, it was $100. I saw it on my table. She came in and it's gone so now. So if she said, if someone told me that in my mind, I'd be like, that doesn't sound like Flo. Yeah, exactly. but then, but then like, just like, automatically. But then they keep pushing. They're like, no, I'm for sure she was the only one that entered. Yeah. And then I'll be like, okay, well, let me talk to Flo. Yeah. And I said no. With her, fingers, with, her, with her fingers crossed. You but you're lying to me? You wouldn't try you, to believe me. No, I would believe you. Oh, okay. 100%. Yeah. Close. I'm just kidding. <laughs> 99, but, 99. But if you ever, if I ever catch you lying to me, it drops drastically. Really? Oh. Yes. You don't like lying at all? No. Don't lie. Oh, okay. Don't lie to me. Yeah. I hate that. I hate lying too. You know, sometimes... <laughs> Sometimes you gotta lie. Don't Wait, so then what's up with her then? What? She hasn't lied, lied to me yet. I haven't lied. Oh, okay. But like, she have you? What, what, what have you lied, lied to me? Wait, we, we have lied to Ty though, but you didn't okay, get Okay, but that was for a good purpose. Like, okay, well, I, I, was, I just miss seeing Ty, so I, I have to lie. Okay, that's good. Wait, for, for context, yeah. I was celebrating. Okay, no, actually, we All were right, doing a potluck. You're gonna make me sound like a bad friend. Yeah. <laughs> we were doing, you're gonna make me sound like a real bad friend. <laughs> we were doing a potluck, and it was a lot of people coming, and Ty was like back and forth. He's like, should I go? Should I not go? And so I told Novi, I texted her. I was like, dude, I think Ty might not go. And I was like, what do we do? And I, th- both of us came up with it or I came up with it. I yeah. can't remember. We we're like, let's just pretend it. We're celebrating my 100,000 followers on Instagram. So she ran out to go get a cake. It was full on party. And then I was like, okay, tell everybody that this is what it's for. And then I texted Ty. I was like, yo, Ty, we're celebrating 100K followers today though. And he's like, shit, I'll go. <laughs> And he showed up and he had a good time. He showed up. He had fun. You didn't know if I was if I was not gonna go. Were you gonna go really? Were you really gonna I feel gonna like gonna you go? weren't gonna go. I, I was gonna go. I feel like go. you were you were like having a time though where you didn't wanna see people. Yeah. I mean, you were like just in, at home and yeah. we, we wanted to see you. So we, we had told a little you. white lie. So you lied it was white to lie. manipulate me to no. come oh, no, through. No, 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 no. You dude, lied to, to make manipulate sure you're well me. Fed. Are you guys hearing this right now? To make sure you're well fed. <laughs> to make sure you're seeing people. I think it's fair. It's like we just love you so much to hang out is with you. Is that love? It is. Is it you though? Know, the you main have to point lie is that me? you know what you know what we gained from this. Say no. You know what we gained from this? A memory. And exp- yes, exactly. Yeah, a memory of you lying to me. No. <laughs> okay, a memory you're... of you celebrating my 100k uh, yeah. okay, is that, on Instagram. Uh, okay, at, you know? like at the last minute that you made. It was. It was a last minute. We had it. Last we had it planned. Last you know, minute. it was a couple hours before. We had candles ready. Right, a cake. Yeah. That she went out to get last minute. No, I got this day off to make sure it was like fresh. Oh mm-hmm. fuck me, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I personally think lies like that are totally fine. You know, especially yeah. when you have a friend who always says no to everything. Hey, I don't like, always say no to everything. Don't say that. Majority of things. Don't say that. Ninety nine. I say yes. Yeah, we're just like I'm here. We're like we're like <laughs> here. We're like Ty. Ty, do drugs with us? No. <laughs> Yeah. Ty, rob a bank with us? No. <laughs> yo, he would be like, yo, do I get a cut? Like, <laughs> what do do? How much can I would never, would He'd never be in rob the a car bank. and be like, guys, guys, I think the cops are coming. I would never <laughs> rob a bank. I would never. I'm way too wholesome for that. <laughs> way too wholesome. You think? You God. think? You think that people should? Who are wholesome? You know how they say people who are humble don't say they're humble. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes, it's the same concept as well, people I who are. I think it. so. Yeah, I have to do it because of y'all. I feel like it's people oh. that they need. Yeah, because they of need y'all. to say Why? it. No, but it isn't like one of those things where they need to say it out loud to gaslight themselves into believing that they are. <laughs> no, no, I have to say it out yes. loud because you guys are gaslighting me in the opposite direction. You think you're so wholesome? No, he thinks, don't. He thinks they're he's so saying wholesome. that guys. now. They're Ty. saying that now. But let's let's, let's put it in the comments. The cameras. Do you guys think Ty is wholesome? Now, granted, you don't fully know him. You just know him on screen. <laughs> How yeah. can you say you're you're trying to sway their opinion? <laughs> granted. Yeah, but they know they've heard me talk. 
Let's say he's wholesome yeah. then. Oh my then that God. makes me Let's wholesome say. because you are who you surround yourself with. That's not with. true. That's not That's true. true. Sometimes you're wholesome. Yeah, we're wholesome. Let's go. We're wholesome. Yeah. Sometimes you do charity <laughs> work. <laughs> oh. Sometimes you, you do say? charity work. What? What? What'd you <laughs> that, just say? That, that doesn't sound <laughs> very wholesome of you. That's not. That's no, not. No, no, no. Mumbling under your mouth no, 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 no. to talk shit is not wholesome. It's not talking time. shit. It's actually. What do you say? It's actually helping you a lot. <laughs> what do you say? <laughs> what do you say? No, what you say, don't Kai? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Damn. Anyways. Damn. Okay. Onwards. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Should broke men date? No. Fuck. Damn, no. No, no, they, they Stay shouldn't date. Home. Stay home and they work. Stay home and make that bake and then come out after, you know? I think it's okay. Personally, it I depends. feel like it depends. depends. Like, like the personality. Yeah. I mean, I feel like if you're if you're broke, you shouldn't be dating with, you know, intent of like having like a long relationship because you're not settled yourself yet. Right? Okay. Yes. Okay. Or it's like if you're just looking to mess around, or whatever. Well, it's like it's like the idea of two holes want to meet together. So it's like, are you? I always ask myself, would you date? Would I date myself? Would you date yourself? Because like, mm. if you're broke, like, are you gonna date yourself? You're just two broke people. So it's like, I think that two people should really be whole and have like a career and have like their life together, and then you can go date. So that way, you can make memories together. Hmm. Actually. Yeah, I see that. But I think some people also probably don't uh, weigh money that much, maybe. I think it depends on the type or, or the expectations of the other person if yeah, you're dating. You know, exactly. like if, exactly. if you find someone that you're dating and that person wants to be like taken out and all these things, then obviously mm-hmm. that's not for you. But if they're right. cool with just chilling yes. at home, then, then it's that's good. fine. Yeah. Oh, it true, works true. out. Yeah. It works out. I'm just playing video games. I'm like, yeah. yeah. And which is a lot of people. Having a picnic in the backyard. You know? That's cute. Yeah. That's, That's actually, actually cute. Better yeah. 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 I would like that more. Yeah. See? In that case, but I come do over. want like <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay. So you would date a guy, Novi, that's Me, like personally? broke, but he's like really good looking a good boyfriend. Is he working? No. Wait, Am he I does, the sugar he's not mama? working at all? He does he just can't find a job, let's just say. Or like for an extended but, period I would say, of time. Like, what is he doing? I, I would say, what is he doing at home? Like, is he just like bumming it, or is he actually like yeah? What is he doing? To he just cooks and cleans. Does he volunteer a lot? No. Oh, okay. Wait, wait, is he being productive? He just cooks and cleans. Oh, that's productive. So, he, so he's being like a, a, a house boyfriend. Husband. Yeah. Hey, that's what house I'm trying boyfriend. to be. <laughs> I mean, if, as long as they're being productive and I'm okay with it because I make enough, then that's fine. Uh, but yeah, if they're see, like, if, but if they're at home just playing video games and I'm doing all the work, then I'd be like, "The mm-hmm. fuck are you doing?" Like you could at you know? least. So do would some you housework. just let him solely be like the guy who cooks and cleans? The house husband. You're not gonna yeah. touch it at all. Yeah. Oh, okay. But knowing me, I'll be touching. <laughs> <laughs> what if he's like bad at cleaning though? Oh, that's oh, tough. Oh, then the that's heck, tough. go find a job right now. Yeah. After your resume. <laughs> <laughs> like you're at home and you can't do this well. Yeah. Yeah the heck i don't know i i find it attractive when a man's like ambitious like even okay. if like mm-hmm. you don't have money at least you're working towards it like you're not just like bum like it out something. yeah yeah i just i just can't stand it when when guys kind of just bum it out mm. and just like float okay yeah know? yeah yeah they kind of go with the wind wherever it takes them it sounds like, like me what the fuck wait really <laughs> <laughs> no that's not true ty when you when you like chose your etsy like you went for it but there's people where, like you give them advice you tell them like hey try this out to improve your uh, life and they okay. don't take that advice I see. yeah yeah i think you actually listen and try to learn when people give you suggestions you yeah. don't just like give an excuse or like shut them down no yeah because i think yeah. i think everyone has something they can teach you yeah that's you so you know yeah see so that's not yeah. bumming it out yeah that's okay. just like you are trying it's just you're trying to find what fits you and right now you have like etsy yeah yeah okay sure sure hi guys okay so our battery died and i'm gonna buy a second one but we're gonna end the podcast now i hope you guys enjoyed this segment of flow and tell say goodbye to ty and novi i'm gonna leave their descriptions and links below they both do etsy uh ty does anime and she does digital products so make sure you guys support them it's somewhere down here novi take it away (laughs) comment (laughs) like subscribe follow this she's a youtuber now (laughs) she's a youtuber now guys (laughs) (laughs) oh Oh, shit don't ruin the set okay have a good one see ya Bye. bye